Welcome to another episode of Timmy Talks in Chandelar. And um, I think we were about to go into um, the uh, the cave of the ice uh, man, right? Ice worm, something like that. Let's, let's have a look. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow. Let's, let's turn the volume down a little bit, shall we? Um, those were a lot of enemies, by the way. Let's have a look. Cave of the Ice Worm. That's it. So, Cave of the Ice Worm. South of Shillcliff Tower. Okay, so this is the place where we're going to go uh, today. But first, of course, a message from our great sponsor, 3 for 1 Trading. 3 for 1 Trading is one of Europe's leading Magic the Gathering retailers. Their online shop has a fantastic selection of high-end Magic cards, especially for vintage, legacy and, yes, yes, old-school Magic players. They now exclusively offer my community free, fully insured and fast worldwide shipping on all their high-end singles, full sets and out-of-print sealed products. They upload new cards every Wednesday and have weekly sale offers and reductions waiting just for you. Use my code TIMMY to get free worldwide shipping on your first order over $500 or euros have fun ordering those cards and thank you 341 trading for sponsoring this video and we are back and uh, i guess ready to go into the cave of the ice worm uh that fork is looking really good by the way that fork will be nice the problem is though look at this no green cards allowed so i think what's this something that i talked about last week i do believe right let's have a look oh yeah we've got this deck Fireball, Lightning Bolt, lots of artifacts, uh, lots of Moxen. Then we've got this deck. Okay, so I guess deck two. Is this is this is this deck any good? <laughs> the deck looks pretty weak, to be honest. Okay, it's got four trikes, I guess. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna give this deck a try. Whatever. Uh, I gotta go south of Shellcliff Tower, which is here. So he's got to walk down. Let's do it. Oh no, oh no. No, 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 no. I don't want to battle a priest. That's, that's, that's horrible. Okay, buy cards. Oh, a crow worm. I gotta buy, I gotta buy everything. These, these, these cards are too cool to, to just to, to leave there. Um, no, I'm not going to do a quest. Wow. It's going to be really tough to get around all these people except tribute for your mercy sure a spell from my deck yes because i want it for your enchantress actually yes great i want to make an enchantress deck um i'm gonna pay you no oh, go away 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 yes i made it oh <laughs> Ah, sorry, but I really didn't want to fight a priest because you, you don't even get a card for it. You know what I mean? It's just uh, it's a lot of work and I uh, didn't feel like it. Um, okay, there are dice there. Sure. A question. Which of these spells requires one green and one colorless mana to cast? The Venom, which I believe is... Venom is two green and one. Is it Elven Riders, which is four? Sylvan, Sylvan is one green and one. Yes, there we go. Okay, let's do another question. What is the power rating of the Dancing Scimitar? It's a 1-5, so it is one power, yes. Okay. Onwards we go into the dungeon. Or I should say the Cave of the Ice Worm. So there's our first opponent. Let's get some dice. Okay, I'm going to gain some extra life. I really wonder if, if, if the deck is any good. We'll see. Start the duel. Uh, wait a minute, I've got no... Could I take a mulligan? Did I miss that? Oh no, oh God. Look at my hands, it's got no lands. This is the worst. Okay, a mock sapphire, that's something. Mock sapphire into brass man. Who needs lands if you've got moxen, right? Whatever. I mean, a brass man's gonna stop the viper, which is important. I can't believe, this is the weirdest hand ever. Okay, strip mine, that's good. At least I can do, well, I can't do anything yet, but I got two lands. I mean, only let this, what, three to cast? That's pretty good. Hey, there's a mountain. 
There, look, now the now my deck's unlocked, right? You can see that straight away. Like, all of a sudden, everything's turning yellow in my hand. I can cast it. That's awesome. That is awesome. I think I'm going to do a trick. I think I'm going to attack with the... Okay, I think we're going to do a trick. Um, this trick involves a correct use of... Um, of lightning bolt. So I'm curious. I just need to time this right. I think he's gonna double block. Hey, there we go. Okay, now I'm gonna fire up the bolt on the war mammoth. Oh, wait, I can't even. Ah, he's double blocking with the viper. I hope that he would double block with the uh, elvish archer. Oh, well. Oh, well. Whatever. I can I can I can do kind of similar trick again. Oh, but he can again double block. Ah, it's so annoying. Let's just play a mountain then and play a card out. Uh Onulet, why not? One and of course we want to keep a mountain untapped for the bolt. Passes a turn. Mm -mm, mm -mm. The Onulet is looking pretty terrible right now, the 2 2. At least it's going to give me some life. Elven Riders. Oh, that's a good. That's a good target for my bolt. Ooh, clay statue. Um, Let's play the clay statue. Man, this is, this is a standstill right here. Which is not good because he's going to play another. Elven Riders. Okay, Giant Spider is not as bad as Elven Riders, at least. Um. Wow, just gonna play Yoshin Soldier last turn. Oh, the Tome is good. Ooh, Fireball, that's nice. Um. What I could do is just attack with everything and then maybe kill two creatures with fireball? You know what? I'm just going to do it. Whatever. I'm going to do it. I like the plan. We're going to see what happens. Whatever. Let's see how he blocks. Very interesting. He really wants to kill. Okay. Okay. Um, done. I'm going to gain some life. Uh, let's deal a damage on there. Done. And now I think I can cast a fireball. Um, target two. Amount of damage to each target. Okay, done. One and two. Look, and then I deal one damage to this. One damage to this. Okay. Is this smart? I don't know, but it kind of feels like something I wanted to do. I think it wasn't smart. <laughs> uh, it was probably stupid, but whatever. I'm on 31. I'm feeling great. Oh man, more creatures. Can we stop casting creatures, please? Okay, so what I could do next turn is untap my Brass Man, right? And then cast Yochin Soldier. I think that's that's an okay idea. Elven Riders. Oh no, not the Elven Riders. I'm already regretting my Fireball move. That was pretty stupid. Um, but yeah, whatever. Uh, I'm just gonna get kicked out straight in my first duel out of the cave of, of the ice worm. Is 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 the deck I built so bad? I mean, I've got a lot of life. I got a couple of turns. If I can just get one land, I can play a trike and I can kill the elven rider. Yay! There we go. Yay! I can. Play trike, trike to the rescue. 
one, two, three. Good, that is dead. That's really important. I think I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play a trike next turn. Uh, then I'm gonna do nothing. Then the turn after I'm gonna attack with everything except for the trike with the counters, I guess. I mean, I don't like it that he's drawing twice as many cards as me with that tome. So that's really bad. So I gotta put some pressure on. Oh no, more stuff. Keeps playing stuff. Stop playing out stuff. Oh man, this is really bad. I guess I could kill both of the archers that so he doesn't have first strike and then he can start attacking with clay statue. Right? I think that's the plan. He, he still has the giant spiders and oh, another elven riders. Uh, now I gotta kill the elven riders. You know what? I'm first gonna see what I'm gonna draw. Another trike. Okay, that's actually quite nice. Um, oh, this is so annoying. Uh, I'm gonna pass turn. Oh man. What was I thinking with this deck? I mean, it's full of mediocre artifact creatures and bird. I mean, what's the plan? You know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm just going to take the damage. Let's attack with the clay statue, see what happens. Let's regenerate. Let's trip a land because I just realized he's using a lot of lands with the tomes. Um, let's cancel, let's kill the spider. There we go. Um, play the brass man, because why not? Yeah, I think my only way out of this is by playing a little bit more aggressive. I think that's that's the way to go here. Maybe next turn attack with Trike and Clay Statue. Untamed Wilds, okay. Fair enough. He's drawing so many cards, it's insane. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna win this this way, so I just have to play a bit more aggressive. Wow, look at this. Um, okay, um, what to do? Let's make this smaller. Um, hmm. If I kill the giant spider, Spider, he doesn't have, I'm gonna kill the spider. Because then he doesn't have anything with four toughness. I think that's good. I mean, maybe he's just gonna play a new giant spider and I'm, you know, it's horrible, but you gotta take the risk. Wow, man, this deck I'm building is horrible. Why did I decide to go into the cave of the ice worm anyway? I mean, it's a fork and a candelabra. I don't need a fork or a candelabra. They're cool cards, but... Well, the fork is really cool. Candelabra is really cool. Too. Okay. Oh, fireball. That's sweet. Uh, let's go. Clay statue. Yochin soldier. Yochin soldier. And you know what? I'm, gonna, I'm just going to attack with everything. And then I can finish him off, I think, with the fireball. 
damage. It's going to take two damage. I'm not going to regenerate. And I'm going to play a fireball. Done. I mean, I still have 19 life. That's something. Ooh, I got a trike to start with. That's really good. Let's let's attack the Enchantress. Enchantress won the toss. Okay. Uh, mountain into soaring. You know what? I'm just going to attack. Whatever. Maybe if I can just kill my own Onulets, I can kind of gain some life this game. I'm really happy with that extra enchantress, by the way. I think I've got three for journey enchantresses now, so. A deck is definitely coming. Um, wow, look at this. This is really good. Um, I'm gonna attack, why not? Let's attack. Okay, uh, I'm also gonna kill the elf. And we're gonna play, I think we're gonna play only that. Oh, I made a mistake. Ah, oh, dang. It's always this with the mana burn. I need to click once, tap the soaring, then pay the rest of the stuff. Ah, oh, man. Oh, wow. Oh, this is... I'm actually happy with this, because now I can block with the Onulet and gain some life. Hey, I'm back up to 19. That is great. Um, let's go mountain. Let's play a bolt. On the Viper. And I'm gonna cast Yochun Soldier. This time I'm not gonna make the mistake. Exactly, I'm gonna tap it the right way. I'm a professional. Chandelar professional. Gonna attack. Go, Triskelion! Do it! There we go. I could have all I could have also attacked with the trike, then played a bolt, but I'm ah, man. Use your brain, man. Use your brain. Hey, the Enchantress. Well, let's attack. She has to block or else she's dead. But even if she does, she's dead because I can just take off the counters. I'm sorry, Enchantress. Hey, Candle Lover of Tannis. Okay, so the only way I can go is play against this Forest Dragon. Um, I'm, I'm a little uh, afraid because the last match went really bad, but we'll see. I want to play first, absolutely, because you've got that creature in play. Now, the great thing is that I'm playing with Brass Man. Brass Man! Brass Man! It's not Sunday, by the way. I'm playing on Saturday because tomorrow I've got a lot of stuff to do with the family. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to play on Saturday. Saturday night. Um, there's nothing I really can do now. So next turn I can cast Onulet, right? Yeah, I've got mountain number three. Ooh, I can start playing Onu. Let's an attack with them. Turn them sideways. I'm worried for the forest dragon because he's he's gonna play out, you know, crawl worms as soon as he can. So I'm gonna attack with Onu. Let. Okay, that's good. Uh, I'm gonna strip a land away because I really don't want him to get the six mana. I know I could have played play statues instead, but. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to attack with everything. I feel like I've got to play full pressure. Okay, going to play Ocean Soldier. Pass turn. Five lands. Next turn, he can start casting Crawl Worms. Which is a real fear. Oh, Thicket is also a problem. Let's untap my Brass Man. Uh, mountain. Wow, what could I do? I mean, I could just attack with everything, right? Yeah, let's do that. Who cares? Let's do it. 
I'm playing uber aggressive. Gaining life, taking names. I mean, four dragons and seven. Please don't cast a crawl worm. Please don't do it. Cockatrice. Maybe that's even worse. <sighs> do I want to untap these dudes or play a clay statue? That's the question. Um, I could untap, hit him again, but I think I'm just going to play a clay statue. I'm starting to understand my own deck, actually. I think I have to play super aggressive, finish it off with trite. Maybe that's the simple strategy of my deck. Oh yeah, an Untamed Wild, sure, man. Oh, I forgot to, oh, that's stupid. I should have untapped these dudes. Okay, he's got two blockers. I've got three attackers that are really not great. Okay, this is the plan. I'm gonna play Clay Statue. And next turn, I'm gonna untap my Brass Mance. Please don't forget. I'm hoping that he's not gonna cast a Crow Worm. And I'm just gonna attack with everything and finish him off with the Fireball. I think that's a good strategy. Please don't cast a Crow Worm. Or another Carcatrice. Just, just so annoying. A Yochin Soldier, isn't that awesome? Okay, he's got three blockers. I've got five attackers. If he blocks my biggest stuff, he's still gonna take three. You know what? I'm gonna attack with everything. We'll see what he does. Sandstorm, no! This is so bad. This is so bad. When when do you ever see Sandstorm? I mean, come on. Come on. Oh, of course, there's the Crow Worm. Oh God, this is really bad. I'm on 11. Um, should I attack with both? Then I put him on five. That's not really gonna work, is it? Oh man, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. This is this this green deck is way too good. Of course, regeneration this makes it even better. Um, Brassman, you were great, man. But uh, it's time to say goodbye. Oh, this is really bad. But I mean, look at look at the cards that he's casting. Um, I'm so close, by the way, because if I attack now with both, oh, let's hope that he's not going to block the clay statue. Who knows? Oh, man. This is so bad. I guess I got to regenerate it. Oh, it's still going to die despite the regeneration? Really? I did not know that. Um, I'm going to die next turn. They're going to throw me out of this. At least I'm going to kill the thickets. You evil thickets. You killed my dear clay statue. I am so dead. The good news is I only lost the desert. Hmm. This was this was a little bit of a letdown. I'm gonna be honest with you. I expected more from my deck. Um, you know what, deck? I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna take everything out. This deck was really, really bad. And I think I'm going to build a Fujuran Enchantress deck. 
Okay, let's start with the Enchantresses. How many do I have? Um, for your Enchantress. One, two, three. I'm also going to play with Tracker, because Tracker's cool. Going to play with Thicket. Going to play with... Ah, Moss Monster's cool. Um, should play with Lunar Elves, kind of ramp my stuff out early, right? Um, what else? I think Gaius Leech really fits in that, right? Into that theme. Let's do Cockatrices. Um, Force of Nature, absolutely. And now, of course, we need enchantments. Um, Hidden Path. Hidden Path is so funny. Uh, Aspect of Wolf, absolutely. Um, Life Force, Counters a Black Spell. Lure, we can play Lures. Let's do two Lures. Mm, regeneration's good. Let's do two regeneration. Sylvans. Let's do a Sylvan. Only one Sylvan? Okay. I like web. You know, webs. Oh, Wonderless. I can try to win via Wonderless. That's funny. But then I need wolves. If I'm going to do that strategy, I feel like I need wolves. Do I have any wolves? Carn Carnivorous plant. Oh, Wall of Ice. Look at that. Wolf brambles. <laughs> I gotta play with a crow worm, right? I gotta do it. Um, okay, so we've got some enchantments. Wait, green enchantments, please. Wild, I've got wild groves. So many wild groves, okay. Let's do four wild growths, right? I cannot do more than four. Okay, let's see what else I got. Berserk's cool. Uh, a single fog could be nice. Some giant growths. I need desert twisters for sure. At least two. On stream of life to gain some life. No tranquility. I mean, come on. I'm, I'm playing with all that stuff. Uh, oh, yeah, and I need hurricanes. Okay, so I've got 44 cards, so I gotta shave a little bit. Let's have a look. I could take out one gas leech, could take out a regeneration. Let's see, 42 cards. So I need I need to shave off four cards still, which is tough. Um, I mean, I can take out a Giant Grove. Giant Grove doesn't really fit in this strategy, does it? I mean, I could... Do I have... War Mammoths. Do I have War Mammoths? I have War Mammoths. I could go War Mammoth, Giant Growth. That kind of works. Mm -hmm. I feel like I feel like it's a good idea to play Wanderlust together with uh, Free Journey Enchantress, but it's going to be tough to keep those. Cre if I want to keep those creatures alive, I got to play. I gotta play wolves, right? So I just need a different strategy. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take out like the the little stuff. Um, take out the fog. Take out the moss monster. You know, take out the thicket, take out the lures, because you don't really need lures in the strategy. Let's put some lands in. I mean, you just, you need, you need 22 force. Well, I guess 21 and then. Oh, and of course, soul ring. Gonna make space for soul ring. You know what? Let's go for soul ring. Where do we have soul ring? Max Emerald, and then we could do Soul Ring. I kind of feel, because the deck is now very vulnerable to uh, to flying creatures, which is a problem. 
Um, also, the deck has a lot of mana, so I think Jam Day Tome could be good. Where do I have Jam Day Tome? Here we go, so I could put in two Jam Day Tomes. Maybe I need some scimitars or put the cockatrices back. I mean, scimitar is almost a wall, right? Let's do crawlworm out. Let's do wolf well, brambles out, carnivorous plant out because they're too big anyway. They're gonna kill the creature that's gonna attack. Um, man, this is harder than I thought. I'm like, I'm just quickly gonna make a Vajern deck, but I just don't, I don't have all the pieces, so that makes it difficult. Um. How many shams have Sylvan, Aspect of Wolf, Wanderlust 6, Wild Grove 10, Regeneration 12. I'm just gonna take the giant groves out. They don't they don't they don't fit the deck. Take Wall of Wood out. Um, Take the tracker out. Although tracker and aspect of wolf is so cool. I want to do that. Let's put the tracker back in. Tracker is too cool not to play. Uh, okay, 61 cards. So I need to do oh, one more card. Let's do a dancing scimitar out. Okay, good. I have no idea if this deck is any good. Probably not, but we're gonna find out. Let's see, where should we go next? Um, Okay, I want to have a regrowth. Azar script contains small black creatures, life loss carried over, east of Nevermore Hill. Okay, where is that? Nevermore Hill. Here's Nevermore Hole. Is it was it Nevermore Hole instead of Hill? Hey, it was Hole. Okay, it was good news. So the hole is over here. So we're just gonna go up. And while we're going up, I'm gonna test my deck. Okay, duel the Sedge Beast. Change anti cards. Sure, duel the Sedge Beast. Play first. Let's check my hand. So, Lana Royals for Juran, Wanderlust Scimitar Force. So, that's actually pretty good. So next turn I can play for Juran, then I can play Wanderlust if he plays a creature. I mean, I feel like I need more enchantments. Maybe I should have played Wep, by the way. Just not realizing. Wep is an enchantment, plus O plus two, great for blocking. Hey, there are graders. So Urk Raiders are perfect. Let me just play my Dancing Scimitar so I can block the Urk Raider. <laughs> and then I'm gonna cast a Wanderlust on Urk Raiders next turn. Ho ho ho! Got a perfect plan. There we go, Scimitar doesn't die. He doesn't mind. Scimitar's fine. Iron Claw Orc, another great target for a Wonderlust. Okay. Wonderlust on the Urk Raider. Gonna draw a card for turn, right? Um, let's play the Lunar Elves. I guess that's the card I just drew. And we're gonna pass turn. Oh, it takes a damage from the Wonderlust. Sure, man, you, you, you do your stuff. Uh, okay, let's do this. One, two, three, and let's not do the one with the blights, obviously. Um, okay, this is good news, pass a turn. Now I've got a blocker for both. Take another damage from the one, the lust. Wait, am I not blocking? Why am I not block? Because I already entered. Okay, whatever, man. A 
Okay, so I can already see a problem with the deck. Not enough enchantments. <sighs> deck building is tough. A fisher. Oh no, he's gonna kill his own. Aw oh, man, dude. That is not cool. Um. Okay, maybe maybe being completely reliant of Wanderlust is not the best strategy. I guess I'm not just going to try to kill him with my scimitars. I mean, there's nothing else I can do, really. Where are all these fissures coming from? A soul ring, really? I mean, you have to admit, I'm drawing pretty horrible so far, you know, this evening. I should just keep playing on Sunday. I have much better luck on the Sundays. Hey, Aspect of Wolf. I love that. Okay, one and two, and let's do it on the Scimitar. And I'm gonna draw two cards. Why am I not drawing any cards? Do I have to click on the Enchantress when I cast the enchantment? Oh God. <sighs> so there are just, there are moments that this game really tires me out. I'm just gonna be honest with you. I mean, uh, this is ridiculous. It should just work. It's an auto effect. Dang it. Hey, Wanderlust. Okay, you know what? I'm going to use my Blightland because I'm just sick and tired. Okay. Select a creature. I'm going to select the Scimitar. Hey, finally drawing cards. I already thought like, hey, the last time I thought I had the Lanoir Elves from the for Jern, but I thought, is that correct? I was in doubt. Um, you know what? I'm just going to attack. Whatever, man. Hey, a Berserk. A card that doesn't really fit the theme, does it? I should probably take out the Berserk. Berserk doesn't doesn't fit this deck. It's weird it's in. Oh wow, really? Did he just do that? Did he make my sim turn 05? What a boss. The absolute boss. Okay, tracker. Ooh, only two more turns. Okay, there's a forest. Can I, I can cast a desert twister, really? I mean, I don't want to, but. Mm, okay, wait a minute. I've got a Berserk. I've got a Desert Twister. He's on two. What to do? He's on two. Um, I'm just going to pass. Going to drop to one. Has to attack, of course. Hey, a wild growth. Draw a card, draw a card. Look, now the deck is working. Now the deck is working. Two green. Gonna use one green for wild growth. Gonna draw a card, gonna draw a card. Gonna play a forest. Gonna use the green, gonna 
Put it on the forest. Okay, now the deck is working. Finally. That was about time. Um, oh no, install a new version. No, 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 I'm not gonna install anything. Stop bothering me. Now I'm a little worried. It has never done this before. I hope it's not gonna crash. Um, anyway, I've got a wall of ice. I've got Dancing Scimitar. I could just pass a turn. He's on one anyway. Hey, he's dead. Take the cards. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go save the game because I was kind of... That was weird. The little glitch. And I'm going to take out the Berserk. And you know what I'm going to put in? Gonna put in the webs. I, th I feel web should have a home here. Right, I'm gonna put in the webs. Maybe just one web, two webs. Um, I'm gonna take out the track. I mean, I feel bad, but Tracker doesn't really, I, I love Aspect of Wolf and Tracker. Also, the art is from the same artist, but uh, they just don't, they don't work in here. Um, take this message east. He will reward you with the white amulet. East. No, I need to go up. I need to go north. I need to go to Nevermore Hole. Nevermore Hole. Okay, I'll du duel you, Archangel. I mean, I've perfected my deck now, so you don't stand a chance. I'm playing web. Okay, Lonerwer Elves. Forest, Desert Twister, Aspect of Wolf, Forest, Forest, Wall of Ice. Okay. This is cool. I can have a turn to Wall of Ice. Yeah! And I can enchant it with Aspect of Wolf. <laughs> oh, sure, man. Be like that. I mean, this is probably the most boring card in the format. Sorts to Plowshares. Uh, what a boring card. Okay, let's go. Forest. Wall of Ice. Pass the time. Another plains, my leech. I've got a wall of ice. You can never penetrate with your onulet. Ooh. Ha 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 This is this is the perfect scenario. I can just this is great. He's on the 21 turn clock. Awesome. I feel super. Onulet's harmless. I can block Onulet for days. Um, okay. All the cards in my hand are really expensive. Unless... In, yeah, only the aspect of Wolf. But I don't want to play because then I'm going to... Maybe kill the Onulet that I don't want to kill. Let's pass a turn. I'm going to take some damage. Uh-oh. Oh, man. I start yawning. He starts playing cards. This is not good. Um... There we go, now I've got a 3-4 big creature. Where's my Fajuran Enchantress? I need my Enchantress to make my Enchantress deck work. No, Wrath of God, no, no, he's back on 23. Okay. I'm also gonna gain some life then. Oh, that Wrath was brutal. Is he going to play a Sarah Angel? Please don't. Please don't. Please don't play a Sarah Angel. Oh, Sarah Angel. I mean, it's a beautiful creature, but... I wish you didn't. Okay. I think I now have enough mana to Desert Twister to Sarah Angel. Yeah, baby. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Sarah Angel. 
Okay, next turn I'm gonna play Gas Leech. I'm gonna give him some forests. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Why does she have so many more cards than me, by the way? Another Sarah Angel. That's not great. Oh, I'm even gonna take a Mana Burn because again, I'm forgetting to first tap the Soul Ring. Awesome. Hmm. Another Wrath, okay. I guess he was really impressed with my, uh, my Gaius Leech. I remember like back in the day, you had a lot of people just playing Wrath of Gods and Resurrections. That's what they did, like, Wrath the board, get back my Sarah. Wrath the board, get back my Sarah. Oh, this is bad news, by the way. How do I use this again? I forgot. Oh no, I'm using it. Oh, I'm using it on the right way, in the right way, I guess. Uh, oh man, look at this. This is really bad. Um, wow. I am afraid that I'm in trouble, to be honest, because those cards didn't look very good. Hmm, oh man. <sighs> Wall of Wood, Forest, and a Wild Grove. I am so dead. I am so <laughs> incredibly dead. Oh man, why do I keep building horrible decks? Um, I'm, I'm not even going to cast it. It's not going to do anything. I'm gonna take eight. Oh, I'm just got two more turns and I'm dead. God, shall I kill myself? I can't. Oh, I'm even forgetting the silver now. Whatever. I'm gonna. I'm gonna lose this match. Oh, I'm gonna lose this match. What was my ante? Goes. I'm gonna draw an extra card. Pay for life. Pay for life. Hmm. I mean, I've got, I think I've got extra Lanarels, so. Yeah, I think, I think my Wanderlust plan is, is, is not good. We're going to do another plan. Let's have a look. Where are those lures again? Look how many lures I have. That's great. I'm just going to put lures in. And then I'm going to play uh, lure with thicket and with cockatrice. It's a simpler approach. It's a better approach. Um, where are my thickets? Where are my thickets at? I only have one thicket basilisk? Really? Uno? What happened? Only one, really? Hmm. That is a that's that's annoying. Uh, I'm gonna throw the walls out. By the way, the walls the walls are too bad. Even in even in Chandelar, even in Chandelar. Uh, I'm gonna go for the big dudes. I could go for the trample theme as well. That would be quite nice. The War Mammoths. War Mammoth, baby. Uh, let's see, how many creatures do I have? Mm. You know what I'm what I just realized? If you put a web on a crow worm, you've got a 6-6 six, six with reach. That's pretty cool. I'm happy with this. I think this is a good deck. Well, good deck. It's good. It's not a good deck, but I think it's going to be better than than the, the other deck. Reward you with any sorcery. I don't need a sorcery, dude. 
Need to go to Nevermore Hall. Onwards to Nevermore Hall. Accept tribute, sure. The location of world magic. I have them all, I believe. 120 gold, fine. Ooh, the Fungus Master. Duel the Fungus Master. Fungus Master starts with a wall of wood. You know, I, I appreciate the Fungus Master. The scariest thing that he can do is starting with a wall of wood. I, I, I appreciate that, man. Okay. Forest, Lana Rouse. I mean, look at me ramping up. I've got Anna Wild Grove and I've got a web. Um, oh, wow. This is awesome. What I'm going to do is I'm going to play Lanor Elves. And that's it. Why? Because if I play web now uh, and Wild Grove, I'm, I'm going to lose cards. So I'm going to play for Journey Enchantress first. I'm going to play it really slow because I want to get the maximum out of my Enchantress. I just really hope that my Enchantress deck is gonna impress me, so I'm gonna keep playing it, because I think Enchantress is such a cool card. Okay, oh, Forest, yeah, this is awesome. Okay, one, two, and this. Play Enchantress. There we go. I think I'm first gonna play a web so that she's protected. There we go, pass turn. I mean, this feels good. I've got an 0-4 with reach. And please be kind to me in the comments. I mean, I know that probably when you're looking at this, you're like, man, why didn't you put this in the deck? Why did you build this deck or it's so bad? But yeah. you know, it's, it's, it's more difficult than you think when you have to kind of Put, put the deck together on the spot, if you know what I mean. Uh, Wall of Brambles. Oh, another Enchantress. I want to get value. Um, one, two, and three. Let's play the Enchantress. Okay. Um, and one. Let's play the Wild Grove. On the fourth, we're going to draw two cards. Awesome, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Um, I can play the Soaring, but I am going to get Mana Burn, and I don't want that to happen, so I'm just going to pass. I feel that Fungus Master is kind of on the same line as my deck, you know? <laughs> Fungus Master and Enchantress, they're, they're homies. Uh-oh, Fungus Master is going to do something big. Oh, there's a Fungusaur. Uh, let's go Forest. Let's go Soaring. Let's do this. Let's cast this creature. War Mammoth. And, oh, I got enough for Gem to tell him as well. Got lots of mana. Okay, and I'm just going to pass the turn. The War Mammoth is big enough to stop the Fungusaur, so don't have to worry about that. Oh, and I'm summoned. Oh, the Fungus Master's too good. <coughs> oh, man. Another Fungusaur. Hmm... I hope to find an enchantment. Unsummon, okay. Oh, a lure, actually. That is an enchantment. Hmm. Okay, this is going to be... I predict that next turn is going to hurt for me. I mean, at least I can block with my enchantress. She's an 04, so... Let's block. Okay, 
Okay, this is quite nice. Uh, we're going to play the lure. I'm going to draw two cards. Awesome. Um, I'm going to play the Crow Room. Why not? Ooh, and I could put the lure on the Crow Worm. Oh, but I want that to be a surprise, actually. So I'm going to do this first. Oh, wait. Already used the Soaring. Let's play the War Mammoth. Oh, now we've got two really big creatures. This is going to be fun. I mean, he's got the carnivorous plant. It's actually, if I put a lure on the crawl worm, I can kill, for example, both of the fungus swords. But I think you want to keep the lure for, oh, look at this, force of nature. Yeah, that's a better, that's a better lure target. You know what? I'm just going to put it on there straight away. Don't have the patience. Oh, very cool. And then I can play the Emerald. Done. And I can draw another card with the Tome. Another lure. Okay, that's really funny. Uh, I don't want to attack. So next turn, I'm going to do my big attack with Force of Nature. This is my favorite art by far, by the way. Uh, and of course, Crawl Worm and the other creature. Okay, but first things first, we got to pay the upkeep cost. So that's one and two. There we go. Draw for turn. Okay, it's a forest. Um, shall we tome? I'm going to tome. Another enchantment would be really nice. Aspect of Wolf. Ah, that's unfortunate. Aspect of Wolf would be really, really good. Um, I'm going to attack. Wow, look at that. Okay. Um, I can deal four here, and then I can kill the wool of... You know what? I'm just going to put four damage on. No, not all. Oh, I put everything on the creature. Then he takes trample damage. Yeah, you win the game, but I guess it's good winning the game. Hey, you're giving me a wall of wood. I really appreciate this, dude. Black Wizard is attacking what now? Let's see where that is. All the way over there, but I'm so... Uh, I guess I gotta go there. Okay, cards and hints. If you combine Pit Scorpion with Taunus's Wand, I know, I can make the Pit Scorpion unblockable. I know, I know. Trade blue amulets for blue cards. Well, I don't really need blue cards. As a matter of fact, I probably need to sell some stuff. Let's sell the stuff. Too many good... I'm not even going to look at the black cards. Too many good black cards. Uh, I'm going to go and transport. Let's play against a Nether Fiend. Cockatrice. Change anti-card. The lure. Okay. Lure. I can... I can lure is better. Duel the Nether Fiend. Okay, let's go forest. Yeah, I guess wild growth is the right thing to do. Let's ramp up the place. Pass. Forest. Shall I play? No, I'm not going to play regeneration on that. Wow, he's not finding any lands. Okay, um... I've got a very slow start, by the way. Force of Nature in hand, Desert Twister in hand, Stream of Life, Crawl Worm in hand. There's Soul Net. Okay, so go for Forest. Shall I just play a big Stream Life? Why not? Stream of Life, I mean. Why not? Okay. 
Okay, there's a forest. There we go. Now my hands opened up. Let's go for crawl worm. I've got two force of nature in hand. That's kind of insane. I mean, this is not this is not ugly art. Don't get me wrong, but this just for me is so iconic. This force of nature art. There's a black knight. Uh, ooh, I'm gonna play enchantress. Regeneration on the crowbar. Finding a forest. Okay, let's attack. Boom, there we go. I think I'm gonna to try to collect like four thickets and four lures, you know, kind of the traditional deck with the Enchantress. Ooh, this is really good. Double Black Knight. That is really good. Um, I think I'm going to... No, let's Desert Twister, one of the knights. Then let's attack. Okay, and then play Lanawer. Passes the time. So he can double block, however, I have uh, regeneration, so exactly, he's not going to do it. Uh, let's play Force of Nature. Here is the Force, dudes! Okay, Force, eat him up. Cost, draw a card for turn. Let's attack. He has to block, right? Uh, I can just put everything on one. Exactly, then he dies. Hey, there we go. Okay, so, um, let me save. Yeah, I think we've been playing for like an hour, a little bit more, right? Uh, anyway, thank you very much for watching. I think next time... Yeah, maybe just go to Azad Script again and... Oh, this is also a good one. You know what? We'll just focus on Azad Script, try to get the regrowth. I think Force Field is really good as well. And in the meanwhile, maybe trying to get some more Thicket Basilisks, some lures, kind of work on this for Journey Enchantress deck. And of course, try to get for Journey Chandra's number four, because they only have three so far. So I think it will be really, really cool. Um, anyway, thank you very much for watching another episode right here on Timmy Talks, the channel where we talk old school magic. Um, and before you go, of course, leave a like, share it on your socials, uh, leave a comment. All, uh, all of this is free and really helps the channel move forward. And talking about moving forward, I also have my very own Patreon page. Check out patreon.com slash Timmy Talks to find out how you can become a patron. And if you become a patron as a protocol sorcerer level, uh, your name will be mentioned in the end scroll at the end of every single video. What end scroll? This end scroll. What shall we do with the drunken sailor? 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 What shall we do with the drunken sailor?
Kikitus, thinkitus, somba kazi.